One of the staple items the Roadrunner Food Bank gives out is peanut butter. From summer 2020 compared to now, they've experienced a 211% increase in buying bulk. Operating 24-7, helping the community never stops for the Roadrunner Food Bank. There's been an increase in people experiencing hunger, um, and so we want to make sure that we're meeting those the needs of those people. Kim North with Roadrunner says the demand increased at the start of the pandemic. And 20 months into it, the need is still there. At Roadrunner, we know that one in six New Mexicans are experiencing hunger and one in four children are experiencing hunger. Now, supply chain issues are impacting the food bank. We have seen an increase in prices. North says the Roadrunner team has been mindful of the bottlenecks, so now they're ordering well ahead of time. We haven't had any major shortages. Because of the increase in prices, North expects some New Mexicans will need their help this holiday season. With a season of giving here, North is encouraging New Mexicans who can to give to the community. We encourage you to give time by volunteering. We encourage you to give funds by donating. And we encourage you to give food by hosting a food and fun drive. The Roadrunner Food Bank has two major food distribution events that you can volunteer your time at. Head to their website for more. Reporting, I'm Stella Sun, KOAT Action 7 News. If you'd like to donate money, you can do that on their website. And the link to all the drop-off locations throughout the state are on the As Seen on 7 section of KOAT.com. <laughs>